We are back again here at the command center of the JW Solar USA. This is the Magnosign Magnum, the, the MS4024 inverter charger with the Magnum, the MMP5020. D distribution center or load center you call it well this is a machine I'm building right now for one of my clients so it's almost done but what I'm gonna do right now the main topic of this uh, incorporating um, midnight classic into this Magnusign beast right now we have here sitting here like a monster it's waiting to take in care take care of business and uh they're going to be running with uh, lithium ion batteries made by uh, nissan leaf so i'm going to be showing you what i'm going to be doing here right on the side corner here is going to be this knockouts or this one here is going to be the this one or this one here it's going to be um the midnight classic 250 made by midnight solar these are all american product so this is how it's going to look like so i'm trying to incorporate here i'm going to take this knockout filter on the corner and i'm going to put um, um a thing there a nipple and um that's going to be uh hold holding this uh, device right here to be on this but today i'm not gonna mount it i'm just gonna show you what i'm gonna do because if i want to mount it this thing has to has a have to have a support to hold it on the other side here or else it's gonna be um swiveling back and forth which i don't like it's gonna fall apart or maybe it's gonna uh damage the charge controller on the side here because it's a kind of kind of like a cast iron a cast metal so this is what i have i got a bunch of uh, goodies here you can see i'm gonna be using and uh, see which one works best and to incorporate into that uh, device right there for the knockout and we go from there so guys this is the system and this is what i'm doing and this is what we gonna be doing live here at the JW Solar USA, the command center in Minnesota, USA. Thanks for watching. Love you guys all. And give a like, subscribe, and share the video. As always, bye for now. So right now the process is gonna start. I'm gonna punch a hole into that. On that side, big knockout right there and go about it. Okay. Go about this. All right, stay tuned. All right, guys. Um, punching, already punching the hole, and uh, get this guy in, and right here. So this is the other side that is going to go to the uh, the classic, this side. So it's going to be mounted now. These things are really hard to uh, punch though if you don't be careful most of the time. Like this one, you see how it is? It's well sealed. See this one here is kind of a little bit cracked. You can able to pop that thing. But as soon as you pop, maybe there's another way. But this is a single. It's easy because to put like the midnight, uh, um, so the uh, lightning arrestor. So this is just one thing, but this has this cover is just this one you want to use and you're using the entire one here due to sizes. But this I already installed this nipple here and I'm going to be taking the Midnight Classic and I'm going to incorporate this one here. You see the hole right there? Right there. See that hole? So this guy is going to fit right there. Let's see. Voila, it's already in. So, good job. See, see that hole right there? And 
there you go it's already attached so it's gonna stay like this and attach this thing and it's all done well this completes our session how you go about installing um, a midnight a midnight classic 250 into MMP 250-30D um, distribution center for a Magnusign MS4024 installation. Live here at the JW Solar USA. Thanks for watching. And this is how it is. Look at that. Nice and snuggle. So this panel is going to be mounted on these holes right there on the side and all that. So if you like, give it a thumbs up and share the videos and see how everything is working here at the command center of the JW Solar. Just another video for you guys. Stay tuned. And uh, for full installation of this uh, device. And um, we can go from there. Bye for now.